Hey guys, what's going on? James here, back with Get On Stream. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add a scrolling text effect inside OBS or Streamlabs so that you can have that same sort of effect that a news channel would have scrolling along the bottom of your stream. Maybe you've got an announcement you want to share with a scrolling effect. Maybe you want to have your followers come in with a scrolling effect. Whatever it is, you can add this effect. It's actually really easy to do and we don't need any external plugins. You can also use Use this effect to create a really cool background with your logo which i'm also going to show you in this video so let's go ahead and jump into it just before we do please do like and share the video hit subscribe if you are new here and let's show you exactly how to do this it's actually really really easy so we're going to come in here to Streamlabs. you can see i've got like a template set up right here so what you want to do is come over to sources click the plus right here i'm going to add in text now you can add this effect to anything in obs or any layer in obs but i'm going to go ahead and add this text effect right here we're just going to name it text gdi you can name it whatever you want and i'm just going to put in this is sample text so you can see that text is now coming up at the top of my screen here uh, in the left hand side so next thing you want to do is obviously you know if you want to change your font or size or anything like that you can go ahead and do that in here once that is done you can come in here and click the done button right click now on that text the layer come to filters and click edit filters we want to add a new filter the filter we're going to be adding is called scroll right here in this drop down it's also inside obs it's a default for all of these softwares so i'm going to click add on this uh, and you can see we get some settings right here so for just a general scrolling text effect i would recommend putting your horizontal scroll speed to about 100 or in around that and you can see it moving along the top of my screen right here what i'm going to do is set my limit width to the same size as my scene in obs or in streamlabs which is 1920. so now you can see this goes right along the top of my screen so that's looking good it's giving me the effect that i want you would probably place some sort of banner or something like that behind this i'm going to now close this out and if we edit our text right here probably want to put some spaces between each message so it's just repeating that message over and over again you can see here we can adjust the size if we wanted to make this bigger if we want to bold the text uh, we can go ahead and do that in the text editor so that's pretty much it for the scrolling text effect that's all that you need to do but this effect has some other features so if we go back into the filter section and we add uh, a vertical scroll speed to this so if we increase that you'll see we start to get this weird effect so you can do this with text there might be some reason that you creatively come up with that you can use this for i really can't so i'm going to set this to zero for now if you go ahead and put this to a minus number your text is going to start going the other way so if you want to have your text coming from left to right put it as a minus if you want it right to left put it as a positive so that's it for text that's all we need to show you that's how you create a scrolling text ticker inside obs now you can obviously hook this up to different text sheets and stuff like that so you can use it with programs and have information coming in there and have it scroll now i'm going to click close on this and i want to show you one more thing i'm going to grab a, an image here of a logo that i'm going to import into obs so i'm just going to drag this logo in uh, you can see it now up in the top left of my screen. It's kind of uh, a typical gamer logo right there. So what I'm going to do on this is I'm going to right click on it. Again, I'm going to come into filters, edit filters. Now you can add this filter of, you know, so the scrolling effect to anything, to videos, to uh, whatever you want inside OBS. So what I'm going to do is set the horizontal speed to about 150 or so here or 120. Uh, and I'm also going to set the vertical speed to the same. Now you can see it's starting to scroll right here. So that's pretty cool. What I'm going to do is set the limit width again, 1920. And I'm going to set the height this time as well. So it fills up the whole screen. And you can see we get this really cool effect behind or in our background here that scrolls and has our logo on it now this is really cool for your brand you could have this animation right here you know actively on a be right back screen or a start screen you could obviously overlay some text on it you can do whatever you want but i think it's a really cool effect animation here in the background and you can actually see it really doesn't use much power of your cpu at all my cpu is using like 1.4 percent down here in the corner and that's actually high this is Streamlabs, so if you use OBS, it's going to be even less. But it's a really cool effect, and I think it looks amazing for like 
you know, you just have in here in your background. If we, for example, just put it back a couple, you've got your overlay over it. Just for certain screens, this is gonna be a really cool effect for you guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you're new here. We're trying to hit 1,000 subscribers. We're at about 850 right now, so we're getting pretty damn close. Hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next one.